Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Coffee Bar Live. We are going a little bit earlier today because I'm en route to Sydney for another edition tomorrow of today's show, which is so exciting. Oh my god, the lighting in here is really shit. <laughs> Hey Joe, don't you just love it when you're in different places? Hey Georgina, and um, all of the stuff and the things are going on. So can you just guys let me know? Like, hey Georgina, can you let me know that you can hear me okay? That'd be really good. Um, okay, so I'm assuming that we that you can. Yes, okay, so that means that you can see me. Okay, and you can hear me, not just see me, but you can actually hear me. Okay, fantastic. Let's see if I can find. Oh, I think that's a little bit better a little bit more flattering isn't it okay so there we go okay lovely thank you so much so what I want to chat with you guys a little bit about today is a, a thing that I think is actually really important and helpful in terms of your creative process now you know what it's like when you are going out right and it's like you, you dance 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 and there's a bit of like pent-up energy and and then it's just like you're kind of unleashed so this is what I think is really helpful when it comes to journaling and, and letting your creative ideas come out. And something that I tell my clients to do all the time and something that I do all the time, in fact, I'll, I'll tell you a bit of a story about what happened with it yesterday. It's kind of like if you're feeling creatively blocked, if you're feeling like you don't know what it is that you're going to talk about or what it is that you're going to say or what it is that you're going to write or what blog you're going to do or how you're going to best communicate with your audience, with your people and, you know, your, your hot, cold clients and, and helping them to hear something that they really need to hear, it can be like... You know how, I don't know if you've ever experienced this, I know for me, it's like, I'm like, oh, that'd be a good idea, or sometimes it's really kind of fragmented, and then you do one thing, it's like, no, nah, that's really shit, and then you do something else, it's like, yeah, no, that's not right, that's no good, and sometimes, and a lot of the time, what we'll then do is we'll kind of stop, right, because it's like, oh, it just feels really fucking hard, so one of the things that I'd really encourage you guys to do is grab out your journal or grab out your computer, whatever it is, however it is that your words flow, the, the, the easiest, the fastest and things like that. And what you want to do is you want to try and break the seal. So you've got to keep writing until you break the seal. And it's once that seal is broken that all of the ideas start to flow. So one of the things that I did yesterday, I was like, okay, I want to start talking about um, Visible Live that's happening on the Gold Coast in August really excited about that I want to start promoting it and I'm like okay yeah it's going to be three days and then I've kind of gone like hmm all right and and I kind of reverted back to the typical sort of marketing sort of talk right it's like oh like if these are your problems and then this is what you need to do and you know whilst that is not like that's you know important you know the only reason that you guys would come along and spend three days in in a room whether it's you or you know someone like you is if you know that you're going to walk out with your problems solved right and that's fine and and people need to understand what the problems that they have what the, what the problems they have and that they're going to be solved but I suppose in terms of how we connect with them first of all it's like well how about we connect with them emotionally first how about we actually find a way to talk to them relate to them connect with them and stuff like that and then we get into the the other stuff and then it becomes it, it turns into that more tangible piece so I was kind of like oh, this is really fucking boring. You know, you don't need to hear somebody else say if you've ever felt stuck with your marketing, you know, if you feel like you need a marketing plan, if, you know, if you're having problems with consistency, you know, every man in his dog is talking about that. And I was, and I got a bit pissed off yesterday because I'm just like, far out, man. You know, I, I know that there's a whole load of ideas that, that are sitting there sort of like waiting to come out that I hadn't found the way to be able to break the seal in order to be able to get those ideas out trust that that makes sense and so what I was doing is I was just I was writing all of these different things down just writing hey Bonnie good morning writing 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 and then all of a sudden it was like all these other ideas started to flow and then it was like bang like the next thing just went Poof. like oh this is amazing this is fucking fantastic and so then the creative bubble was able to kind of like burst there was like the, the, the angels sung and there was fireworks from the sky and you know all of the, the confetti and the ticket tape parade you know all of the stuff happened it was just fantastic but it took 
almost like, um, I guess it's a bit like labor really, you know, it takes all of the hard work before you can bear the fruit of, the, of all of that hard work and for the most part, enjoy it. So, you know, that's that. I was chatting with another lady, a client of mine yesterday, um, in a like every a couple of times a week there's a, a really quick kind of like check-in call that we do and it's like what are you celebrating and, and what do you need help with and one of the things that we were talking about was some of the theming for one of the workshops that it is that she wants to do and so we started talking about castles and we started talking about you know the different rooms within a castle and about how like these ideas can kind of like stack together and to make this really beautiful and amazing thing but it's like how do you build anything is like brick by fucking brick right so room by room brick by brick so we were able to build this whole sort of like i'm going to call it themology into what it was that she was doing and it was just like oh man but it takes that that first little seed of of an idea and then kind of watering it nurturing it and that's that keeping looking for the next what's the, what's the best way that I could talk about this and what's the next best way that I could talk about this and how else can I talk about this and what else can I talk about and how else can I talk about this and you know constantly going into into that sort of mode in order for those ideas to then, so, then start to flow and start to come out so the first thing that I would do if I were you is either in a word document or in your journal is get this stuff to start writing and it can be like sometimes in my journaling i'm like i don't know what the fuck i'm writing i don't know what i'm saying like this is really boring oh my god this is so boring like is there anything else that i could write about what else can i talk about and i might say oh look at that the lights are orange and the walls are orange and the cushions are really comfy and you know you're just talking about the mundane of things and then it's like something will then kind of like drop in or something will come through your pen or through your pencil and then it's just like bang you know there it is so they are my words of wisdom for today a short sharp and sweet coffee run uh, coming to you live from the airport en route to sydney um i can confirm that we're on air tomorrow at 9 50 uh so i'll be doing the whole sharing you some of the behind the scenes stuff that'll be fun um and yeah so 9 50 it'll, it'll go for maybe about five minutes i think uh, so it'll be very fun and exciting. I can't wait to share the adventures of the today show with you tomorrow. <laughs> All right, everybody. Have a really great and amazing day. If you've got any questions about this, if you need journal prompts, let me know. Otherwise, go kick some ass, have fun doing it, go help some people be visible and just get out there and change the world. I'll talk to you tomorrow.